In this video, we are going to look at how you can reverse the path order of any view in Swift UI. Reversing the path order allows you to draw or animate the starting point or the end point of a stroke in any direction. For example, in this video or in this project, we want the stroke to draw from the top in the clockwise direction. Now, if I go to the trim and change the starting point, look at how it is drawn. Our aim is to draw the stroke from the top in the clockwise direction. To do that, we need a technique to flip both the starting point and the end point values of the stroke. First, let's do that in Sketch so that you understand how it works. In Sketch, I have the same circle. To begin, let's convert the circle into an open path. With the circle selected, we go to the inspector and choose the dash field. Here, I'm going to enter 1000 and use the down and up arrow keys. Now, I'm using the down arrow key to increase the gap. As I said before, we want the stroke to draw from the top in a clockwise direction. To do that, with the layer selected, we go to layer, path, and reverse order. Next, we have to flip the layer horizontally and vertically. We go to the inspector, still the layer selected, and click flip vertically and flip horizontally so now if i go to the dash field again and use the down arrow key or the up arrow key you can see we are drawing the path from the clockwise direction here we already have the open path first change this value to 2 so that we have just half of the circle. Next, we have to flip the layer so that we can draw the stroke from the top in clockwise direction using the starting point. To do that, we need 2D rotation and 3D rotation to flip the layer start point. I'm going to enter rotation effect and the angle, we have to set it to 90 degrees. It is going to start from the top. Now, let's draw the stroke again. Let's change this to 3 and 4. We have now used 2D rotation of 90 degrees to rotate the starting point, but still we haven't flipped the starting point. We add 3D rotation. We set the degree value to 180 change the x value here to 1, y to 0, and the z value to 0 as well. So now, if I change this value to 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9, as I change the value, you can see we are drawing the stroke from the top and also in clockwise direction. So this is how you can use 2D and 3D rotations to flip the starting point of an open path so that you can draw it from any direction you want.